Hey guys. Welcome back to another video today. Well, let's start out like this. This is going to be a three part series or two part. Yeah, because today I will be, I'm sorry, this is not a try on haul. I'll pro um, we'll see, it might be a three part series. But anyway, this part is going to be showing you everything I got for, uh, for back to school. And we went to like Nike, um, Rue 21, Aeropostale, Bath and Body Works, like everything. Um, so yeah, this is going to be the first part. And then the second part will be going through my closet, which I'm filming later tonight. And then, yes, I know it's like 11 in the morning. And I'm filming this at a random time. Anyway, sorry, that was off topic. Anyway, and it might be a third part because I might do a try on haul later, but it probably won't be. It'll probably be later, either this month or like in September or something. Because I really don't feel like doing another try on haul. Because I've been doing Shein try on hauls because I'm addicted to Shein. And you might get lucky. You might have it soon. You might not. We'll see. We'll see how I feel. Okay. Anyway, let's just get right into it. Okay, so the first place we went to, well, it wasn't in order, but the first place we went to is, oh my god, come over here, Bath and Body Works. So, Bath and Body Works was having a 75% off sale, and people were going crazy in there because they just had, like, red buckets filled with stuff and you could just grab it and put it in a bag and it was all 75 percent off so that's really fun so i'm going to show you all that i got it's not really back to school but i can use it all for back to school so i'm shocked and i'm so proud of myself for only getting one perfume because if you guys do not know i'll insert a photo right here if you do not know this is what my perfume collection looks like and currently it's busting open. So, I only got one perfume and I'm so proud of myself. So, the one perfume I got was Open Sky and it smells so freaking good. This is what it looks like. It smells like... Hmm, how can I explain it? It definitely... It's like... When you walk into a mall and you just like go into Bath and Body Works, it's literally this scent. That's all I can explain it because I don't really know mm, ingredients. Water, cool. Does not say what thing it is, whatever. But like, if you guys know that scent when you walk into Bath and Body Works, it is literally this scent and I love it. Next, I got this for my locker specifically, but I could use it anywhere. So technically, this was for back to school. So it's antibacterial hand spray and it's hand sanitizer, and I got it in mahogany teak wood. Oh my god, this smells so good. I've noticed that I'm well. This also smells like cologne, and I really like cologne. Obviously, I'm not gonna wear it, but cologne smells delicious. And this smells like cologne. I'm a teak wood girl. I've. <laughs> Ew. I'm a teak wood girl. Um, I have like a ton of candles with like mahogany and teak wood in it. So, I thought this was perfect for me. Then we got some room spray. We have White Barn Paradise Cove. This smells super good. Again, it smells like, I did not realize how much stuff smells like cologne, but this smells like cologne and it's super, you gotta be careful with a Bath and Body Works sprays or room sprays because they can be so strong. So I feel like that one, I would only need to spray once or twice, depending like I would be on that side of the room and that side of the room and that's it. Anyway, now it's just, I believe shower gels and lotions. So the shower, the one shower gel I got is Bahamas Passion Fruit and Banana Flower. 
Smells delicious and the packaging super nice. Oh, I guess I can show you the, here's the room spray I got. It has palm trees. Um, and then here's just the antibacterial spray. Anyway, this is super cute and it's pink, so I love it. And then I smelt it and it smells amazing. I just, I have super dry hands. That's one of my like pet peeves, I guess dry hands i hate it i hate it i hate it i hate it chalk gives me the creeps chalk boards give me the creeps anything dry just ugh, get away from me so i go through like 50 bottles of lotion this isn't a lotion but i'm super excited so yeah um this is called sunset glow it's now we're down to the last three things but these are all body lotion this smells like hmm. it kind of smells like something it's a mix of this it's literally actually it's almost exactly a mix of this and a mix of open sky. I just figured it out. This is what they used. No, not really, but it's literally a mix of those two. Because you get the fruitiness from this, the passion fruit, banana, flower, whatever. And then you get the bath and body work scent from open sky. I cracked the code. Anyway, this one smells super good. I so so far I got these all from the 75% off sale. Then we have this one that smells amazing. I'm telling you. This one I'm probably I'm probably I'm probably gonna keep at school. Or one of these are gonna be kept at school because I got three and I don't need three. But it always occurs to me that I don't have lotion at school and my hands are always dry because water makes my hands dry. So it's always good to have lotion if your hands are like me. I'm probably going to keep this one at school because it smells delicious. But it's called Midnight Swim. It smells so good. It smells like... Hmm. No, it doesn't smell like this. It just, oh, what does it smell like? It's something I have. Anyway, definitely get, if you're like me and you like cologne-ish scents, get my night swim, get mahogany teak wood. Like, yeah, I'm weird. I know, I know, but... Midnight Swim is probably my favorite one that I got. And this one I specifically bought. Like, this was not... Oh, and this one's from the 75% off sale. And that's the last of the 75% off sale. This is the last thing. Um, I got Sunrise Woods, which is one of their newest collections. For, like, fall, I think. Oh, wait! Sunset Glow has Shea Butter and Vitamin E. This one has... Shea butter and coconut oil. This one, shea butter and vitamin. Okay, that didn't help. I thought it was in like the smell, but no. Anyway, this smells so good. It's kind of like if you guys have ever had a pop, like a s'mores pop tart, it literally smells like that. That's the scent. And it smells really good with a mix of like perfume. It smells super good. Anyway, that's my Bath and Body Works haul. Wow, that took up nine minutes of this video. This video is going to be long. Okay, it's okay now. And they're all back in. Next door. Now the next door. Ow, my arm hurts. Next door is Rue 21. So, first thing I got was this now we're on to the clothes that was the only thing besides shoes i got that weren't clothes 
Um, so this really cute sweater. I have brownish, like, jean pants-ish. And it'll look super cute in the fall time. I'm really obsessed with it. Um, so yeah, really cute, really cute. Next, I got this shirt that says Never Been Happier. And it's super cute, super, well, it's just kind of like an oversized tee. And I can pair it just with like pink shorts or yellow shorts or something like that. Because it has so much color on it. So yeah, super cute. Then, there was a sale going on. There was a lot of sales that you could get on clearance shirts for four dollars so i got this shirt it has a little cutout of a sunflower on it and it's super cute i'm really obsessed with it i like the color too and it's not too cropped which is things i was looking for i wanted not long t-shirts but I didn't want cropped t-shirts either. Sorry, my nose is super stuffy if you couldn't already tell. But this is a super nice length. It's not too long and it's not too short. Um, and I can also just pair it with jeans or something. White shorts maybe, you know, you know. Um, this one, I think, was not, it was not on clearance. But it's so cute. Look at how cute this is. Move tag. Nobody likes you. Um, it says, evolve and grow. Natural beauty. A little change is good. It just is super cute. And it's giving me Rania vibes. If you don't know who Rania is, basically she's one of my best friends. And she, well, now she's moved. But she's coming back next year. Anyway, she likes, she's basically me. We both love the same style. So, like, we like butterflies and flowers and these type of t-shirts. So, it's giving Rania to me. But, super cute. Love it. Shout out to Rania, by the way. Then, this was another shirt on Clarence. I got this, and it's exactly like the yellow one. Just, it has a butterfly cutout on it. Again, super nice length. Um, I need more t-shirts like this because... Some t-shirts are kind of cutting it close with the cropped. And I'm not trying to get dress coded because I've never gotten dress coded. And I want to keep that the same. So, yeah. I really like this. Super cute. Again, $4. So, I'm like, okay. What a deal. This was on sale. This was. Or this is. This shirt, it has one of those little dragons on it, and it's super cute. Again, nice length. I think it'll be a little shorter on me, though, because it it's definitely, like, meant to be a crop top. But we got it in a nice long size. Sometimes it's okay, because I'm not the size this shirt is in. Like, this is not my size. But it's okay, because the reason why we got this is because... We needed it to be long. Long, honey. Mm -mm. Okay. Well. Yeah. Super. Get out of here. Super cute. And then. The last thing I got. Was this super freaking cute hoodie. I did not just say that word. I said freaking. Sorry. That sounded like it. Anyway, I got this super cute hoodie that says, Greetings from Los Angeles. Relax and chill. And it has cactuses on it. And it has pink on it, which I love. And it's just super cute. I don't have tan hoodies. I just realized that I don't have tan hoodies. Or like brown hoodies. I have literally every other color you can think of. So this is nice to switch it up, you know. And that is all I got from Rue 21. I think a lot of the things I got were things I'm going to be wearing a bunch. Um, 
I definitely know I'm going to be wearing the cutout shirt and this hoodie, obviously. But that sweater is super cute, too. And I'm just really happy with all the things I got from Route 21. Why did Bath and Body Works take up more time than actual clothes? Whatever. Next door. Okay, next door is called Eddie Bauer. And I've never been in this store. I didn't even know it existed. And I only got two things from the store because it was kind of whack. I don't think it was meant for like my age though because a bunch of grandmas were shopping there. I'm so sorry to whoever Eddie Bauer is. I've just been like, this store's whack. Only grandma shop there. Like I was throwing some shade. I'm sorry. Anyway, on with the video. But you know, it's fine. Anyway, they were having a, another sale and they just had like racks and racks <clears throat> outside of the store. And basically all the things outside were $7. And the things inside were like 25. So I snatched up two shirts and they kind of remind me of Lululemon. So I'm super happy about that. I have this orange long sleeve and I feel like I don't have I really don't have orange, like I don't have orange things in my closet. So it's nice to have this pop of difference. It's super cute. It rem again, it reminds me of um, Lululemon. And then the last thing I got was just this plain purple t-shirt. Super cute, I like the length. It's not, well, I didn't want too long shirts, but I did want like some that go down to like my waist or something. Or not waist, hips. And this I feel like is the perfect length. Um, super cute, I really like it. And I can just like, cause I'm doing cross country so I can like slide on these shirts. When it's cold, I can put on this one. And when it's hot, I can put on this one. And like, I can just, slide into it put on some shorts and i'm ready to go so i feel like this these are super nice and they're cotton and i'm like i really like cotton because some shirts i get i don't like the material like it's hard and i'm what was the face i made <sighs> i'm looking to be comfy not in this like what almost feels like denim like i'm not trying to be in that okay so that is all i got from eddie bauer but they were on sale so yeah next door okay so aeropostale is the next door and aeropostale and gap are probably the most i got the most things from so, Aeropostale actually is probably what I got the most of. I've never been to Aeropostale, and my friend Macy, y'all know Macy, right? Has she been in one of my videos? Oh my god, I don't think Macy... Oh yeah, she was. She looks a lot different now, but she was in the Nice versus Mean Mom video skit. And that's when she had long hair. She's going it out again, but she cut it like mine. How it was short in that video. Yeah, I went through a, a little tough stage and decided it would be nice to cut my hair up to my ears. Not a good choice. Anyway, Macy literally loves Aeropostale. Like, she lives off Aeropostale. Half her closet is Aeropostale. So, she brought me into the Aeropostale world. And, yeah, now. I didn't realize this, but I got a bunch of the same shade of purple shirts. Like, I literally got 10. Like, the last shirt from Eddie Bauer. I got, like, three shirts of that shade in this haul. So, first one is, again, that shade. And it just says Aeropostale on it and the when it was established. And it's kind of velvet. So, it's a different material, but I super like it. Super like it. 
Okay. But yeah, it's a nice purple shade. And I don't, I'm, I mean, I'm glad I got this purple because I have like two purple shirts. So it's nice to kind of switch it up. Oh, I got this. Oh my God, my mom really did tangle this, but it says 1111 on it. And it's super cute. Look at that, wait. You can see that. I always make a wish on 1111. So, thought that was super cute. Yeah. Then, I got this shirt that has a butterfly on it. Super cute. Um, obviously, a lot of these say Air Apostle on them. So, I'm going to have a lot of shirts that say Air Apostle. But yeah, super cute. I really like it. Little butterfly. And it's pink. So, gotta love it. Next, I got this cute shirt. It doesn't say Aero Apostle on it, but it has all these striped colors, and I feel like with jeans or with, like, jean shorts or something, I feel like jeans would really match this. Yes, leggings, but, like, jeans all the way. But this is very cropped. And again, same situation. I'm not this size, but I had to get it bigger because it can't... If it was my size, it would be, like, right here. I can't do that. So, it's now a nice size. It's kind of risky, but I still like it, and it's still going to pass. So, there you go. Next, I got these cute little earrings. There was a sale for jewelry, and it was, like, buy one, get one free. That's what it was. So I got these really cute earrings. Those are my favorite, the little hearts. Those are cool too. I like the tiny little hoops. And then we got just got some like moons and simple circles, you know. <clears throat> then I got, this also reminds me of a little woman. It's this just plain blue long sleeve you know you always got to get those plain long sleeves because you never know you might need it you know like you never know maybe like i know map testing and i think everyone has map testing yeah so like what if i'm just trying to be comfortable like a casual day of testing so i can just throw on this some leggings some shoes and call it a day like yeah i'm i'm digging the plain long sleeves anyway um yeah so we just sometimes need to get some plain long sleeves then i got another shirt with a butterfly on it and the same purple shade it says los angeles california I'm shocked it doesn't have air Apostle on it, but it doesn't. It's just a nice little butterfly shirt, and I super like it. So, what is with it, with me saying super like it? I really like it. So, yeah, cute little shirt. And then, this is probably one of my favorite shirts that I got. It's just this plain arrow. It says arrow like a school would. And it's super cute. This reminds me of Macy a lot. So, super fun. This is one of my favorite shirts. Look at how cute that is. Can't tell me it's not. Wait, there you go. Super cute. I love all the colors. And, like, I, again, I can match it with all my funky, because I have a lot of funky leggings and a lot of funky sh um, shorts. And I don't have a lot of funky tops that, like, match. So, this is super nice because now it can match. I love it. The, oh, oh. Then, we have this shirt that says Aeropostle, and it has three butterflies on it. 
super cute. Not much about this shirt. It's just gray, so it can match with anything. Probably some white shorts would be nice because it has white on it. Next, I got this tee. It has a bunch of, I really got a lot of butterflies. And it's in the purple shade again. Kind of looks white to you, but it is definitely the purple shade again. Um, but a bunch of butterflies. I really like it. And again, with a lot of color, I can match it with different shorts. Because I'm a short girl. Or, shorts girl. I kind of, like, hate pants. If y'all talked to my teachers last year, you will know that I showed up in 35 degree weather in the middle of winter with shorts on. So, yeah, that's me. And then I just got some plain cute shorts. These are mainly for home, but when it gets to summertime, I can definitely wear these. Look at how cute. Just some plain green ones. And then I got the same shorts in pink. Um, super cute. I love them. And I can just lounge in them, which I'm looking for because I don't have a lot of shorts. And I can just lounge in. Wow. And Bath and Body Works still beat it in time. That was a lot. Anyway. That was my Aeropostale haul. Um, I really liked all the stuff I got. I'm super excited for those shorts. Oh my gosh, go. So, yeah. And I'm super happy that I got a bunch of colorful shirts. Oh my god. Oh. Because then I can match it with, like I said, a bunch of fun shorts. Always looking for that. So, yeah. On to the next store. We got another doozy. Okay, so this is my Gap haul. Um, <clears throat> Gap is probably one of my favorite stores now. I don't usually get to shop it, shop from there. Um, but last year, because we do this every year, it's now a tradition. It started last year, but we're going to do it every year. <clears throat> and we go to like outlet malls and all that. Um... So, <clears throat> basically, last year, I was kind of just buying stuff to buy stuff because I was, like, super excited. I wanted clothes. <clears throat> and I kind of wasn't paying attention to sizes that much. So, I have zero Gap stuff again um, because they all grew out of me. They don't fit me anymore. So, that kind of sucks. Anyway, this year, I was careful. Um, this was on clearance for $14, but if that, if that's the price it was, imagine the original price of this. But anyway, it says NYC, um, I just liked it because it had the sage green and I liked the design and it's a nice long shirt. So when I wear it, it won't be. It's not too long, but it's not too short either. So, yeah. There we go. Um, this one. These are brown sweatpants. I really, I had white Gap sweatpants last year and they just grew out of me because they were super tight. So, I was super sad, and then I wanted new white sweatpants. And then they didn't have it. So, I got two pairs of different colors instead. So, I got these brown sweatpants. I'm really excited about these because they're just brown. I'm starting to love brown pants, especially love them. Um, especially because fall is coming up. So... Super happy about these. They kind of look black on camera, but I promise they're brown. Sorry. Cover you for a second there. Um, no. Go back. Okay. Then I got this super cute shirt that says, Hello Surf. 
and it just has this nice wave on it and super cute again with the purple i don't know what i like so much about purple this shopping spree but who knows and almost everything was on clearance even my shoes were on clearance and they're both nike so that's they were like sixty dollars for a pair clarence i got these anyway super cute super cute super cute super cute right. <clears throat> this is the exact same shirt i got last year that grew out of me in the second so we got a nice size this time and it just says gap and navy blue writing and then look at how cute this is guys watch wait hold on let me fold this up oh my god hello fold thank you then look at how cute this is I got matching shorts. It's the same navy color and it says Gap and it has white on it. Super, super cute. <clears throat> and then the last thing I got was the exact same pair of sweatpants, just in purple. Super cute. I'm not going to unfold them because those are very nicely folded. <clears throat> and that was my Gap haul. Pretty fun, pretty funky. Now all I have left is Nike and Famous Footwear. So yeah, let's let's end off strong. Anyway. Now here's the hard part. Can I get this in the bag? Let's see. I had quite the troubles with Aeropostale. No, I can't. <clears throat> Go. Thank you. Jeez. Yeah. There you go. Those were quite the grunts. Anyway, now on the Nike. Okay, so we actually went to two Nikes. There was two different ones. We went to a different outlet mall and then a different outlet mall. Because we usually go to one outlet mall, obviously. But we were switching it up this year. But we wanted to go to the stores that this one the one that we spent the most time at didn't have. So we went to the one that we usually go to. So I'm gonna start with the one that we switched up with. So I only got two things and it's this purple shirt and it has um, the Nike symbol on it. And then I got this shirt that I'm wearing right now. And it was, these shirts would normally be $25. So if I got two, that would be $50. And it was a sale. Two shirts for $30. Still pretty expensive, but still super cute. I'm happy. Obviously, I'm I really like this one. I really like the sports wear under it because I don't have I don't this is like my first shirt with the sports wear. I just have the Nike. Anyway, now to the one that I usually get. I'm so freaking mad. I bought these ankle high socks and I was so ready because I, I've been wearing crew socks because I want ankle. And if I turn it around, oh wait, you can't even see that. Can you see that? Stupid. Only the back pair is dirty though. So, still. But still, I'm still super mad. And it didn't fall out or anything. That's just how it was on the back. Anyway, I also got these no show socks just in case I needed no show socks. So now I have crew socks, ankle socks, and no show socks. Then I got this cinched <clears throat> hoodie. I really like it. I feel like it could go with a lot of things like um, white sweatpants or gray sweatpants or leggings or jean shorts I feel like would look like white jean shorts I feel like would look 
super nice. Then I was digging the purple this shopping spray. This is a different shade, but it's still purple. And I really just wanted a shirt to lounge in when map testing or just testing or just a casual day. So I just got this plain Nike t-shirt. It's purple. Purple is not my favorite color, by the way. It's hot pink, so there's no reason why I was like attached to purple. I just was. Then I got this shirt. It's just brown. And we're gonna have to take these out. Oh wait, I can. That's easy. There's shoulder pads in this. So we need to get them out, but otherwise I can just wear the shoulder pads. It's just kind of a weird, like why is there shoulder pads? Otherwise, super cute. I love it. And then lastly, I just got this super cute skirt. It's just orange, super cute. I love it. I love it. Super cute. That's what I got from Nike. That was very quick. I like it. Yeah, I'm super happy with all the stuff from Nike, actually. Ugh. I feel like I just got different stuff. Like, I wouldn't have ever guessed I would buy a, sh a skirt or a brown shirt. I have zero brown shirts, so that's nice. And then, the last thing is shoes, and then we're done. Okay, last thing. I got two pairs of shoes, and they're both $60. I paid for one. So these... Are super cute. They're both Nike Air Forces, but look at how cute these are. They're teal, and they have hot pink on the back and the hot pink on the tongue or whatever. So I can wear hot pink and teal with this, and I literally have a, this exact teal and that exact pink on a shirt up there. Super happy about these. I just got two new pairs of Nike Air Maxes. So now I'll have Air Maxes, Air Forces, everything. I'll just have normal running shoes because I do have that too. Um, but yeah, super happy I got these. I really wanted colorful Nike Air Forces. Um, so I really like funky shoes and like colorful shoes. And then the last thing in this haul is Pretty boring, actually. Da, 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 da. Plain white Nike Air Forces. Woohoo. And the last thing I need to get is, for shoes, is spray. So I can keep them white. Because I'm not trying to dirty up my Nike Air Forces. Not trying to, I mean, I don't really know how to walk without creasing them. But I'll try my best not to. And just, like, taking care of these shoes. Because... I, I'm not trying to spend money on shoes and then absolutely destroy them. I mean, yes, they are shoes, but they're also nice shoes. I, there's a difference between running shoes and, like, normal shoes and nice, like, not gym days shoes, you know? And that is it. Oh, we're done. And besides this, I actually have another bag from Columbia, but I just got a coat. So there's really nothing exciting. Thanks for watching part one of this series. I may post a part two, which is trying on all of it. Probably won't, so don't get your hopes up. But I will be filming me going through my closet later tonight. So stay forward to that. It's probably not gonna be posted either today or tomorrow or sometime. But it's definitely going to get filmed. So, thank you all so much for watching. I'm so tired. I'm going to go eat. Because I haven't eaten yet. See y'all later. Bye. I'm hungry.